Did you spawn yeah, still? One of the so we're getting set up for another game here. Uh, doing 1850. I have one unit of beast attacks there. Can't do this anymore. Beast masters, I should say. Three ravengers, uh, four raiders, two venoms. I got a kind of a high point death star unit there. Uh, Archon and uh, four Incubi, they're in a uh, Venom. And I got just uh, three Trueborns in a Venom. And then I got just uh, racks for troops, three a piece. Uh, they're just basically in there just so I had the vehicles. Uh, the four Raiders, they have retro jets, so they're going to be all deep striking in. And so it's pretty much an, an elite list today. And we'll see how I do against some Solanesh Chaos Marines. So, more to come. So we're getting set up here. Uh, here's the Dark Elder deployment we got first turn. So I got a beast unit there. Did you miss me? Three Ravengers there. Two Venoms. Um, they're outside because I want to get plane tokens onto the uh, elite unit there. And got uh, one Himiklo attached to the racks there. And I got four Raiders in reserves. Uh, one of them's empty, the other two have uh, racks in them. So, pretty pretty much, we're just gonna kill each other. So, opponent's got two Helldrakes. One Dreadnought, and then they got the new little bumblebee type beast. And oh, you know what would be kind of a cool mod for those for the thousand thousand suns? Um, do well, can they? They can take those, right? Thousand suns. Turn them in. Turn them into like uh, the big uh, rhino beetles, and then you know put a rhino beetle head on them. Scarabs. Or make them look like scarabs. You can do one of the two, but usually be beetles are scarabs in a sense. So. Thousand suns are just the future tomb kings. <laughs> so, anyways, <laughs> waiting for the opponent to deploy and see if he can steal initiative, and then we'll go from there. So not much for the top of one. Um, Raider here, uh, Ravenger shot the dread, took out an arm. The vial got in with the incubi into the vehicle, and in the Himikloi, they attached themselves to that unit, and that's about it. Cat moved forward and ran four, and shot here and got one glance hit out of the two vehicles. The penetration hit was made, uh, save, an invulnerable save for that uh, type of uh, walker, and so yeah, so we'll see what damage the Slanesh Marines do and come back for more. So we had a brutal fight here. Um, cats moved forward, assaulted, and um, no overwatch. The incubi, uh, the incubi and the vial, they moved forward, disembarked, and assaulted. I lost the three incubi in the front, lost the upgrade in combat. The Viola was challenged by Lucius, Lucius and uh, killed Lucius with an instant kill. And so that's about it. She also consumed the soul in a soul trap. So now she's at strength six. And cats, they made their charge range 23, were able to swing. The rest of them are fall back. And now we got two Hell Drakes coming in. I also deep strike two rat, uh, two raiders. Uh, I did a lot of shooting at this unit to break them down before I assaulted them. I lost one raider to a vehicle mishap on the district table, and still got one raider over there yet. And so that's it. We'll see what happens. So we've entered into the bottom of three. Uh, it's a long game going on here because we got complex. Uh, we had a complex battle going on. Uh, the vial got killed by the assaulting unit. Uh, just I think it was like five, five hits. I only got one save from the clone field and um, failed uh, two, failed three saves. So that took her off. 
And now we're just uh, trying to weed out the rest of the beast, beast masters and their critters. Um, still got two Heldrakes. We got two Ravengers over there. One raider over there, one raider over there. Still got one raider in reserve over there. I don't maybe he was alive. And um, so yeah, see what happens here because uh, they just passed over that. So we'll get several vector strikes from two drakes. So yeah, still going, but we're uh, treading through it. So for the bottom of three, the uh, cats, they broke away. They lost combat by uh, three models. And um, fortunately, they only moved back six inches. So we'll see if they get to regroup next turn. And Ravengers are all gone. Lost another raider to a vector strike. And <laughs> still got two Hemicloy over there. <laughs> Otherwise, that's pretty much it. We got one obliterator heading over there. That raider's got no gun. Still have one raider in reserve. And um, that's about it. So it's weeding down for the uh, Dark Elder. They have two racks over there. Two Venoms. One has uh, three units in it. They're right there. And then we got another raider over here, and that's pretty much it. We got two Heldrakes left, two Rhinos, two guys hanging out over there, and two of the uh, new walkers for the Chaos. What are they called? Uh, those ones are Forge Fiends. The Force Fiends? Forge. Forge Fiends. Yes, sir. Yep. So, and I got two Mikuloi hanging out over there. Oh, and I got him. He made an insane heroism on his fallback. And um, so, we'll just, you want to just call it at the bottom of five too? Because uh, there's really no reason for us to drag on. So, um, that's it. That'll be, uh, we'll follow up at bottom of five here and more to come. So, we have reached the bottom of five after four hours. Well, almost, was it almost four hours? Because we didn't really start till like one or so. Yeah, it was after Yeah, so about four hours of gameplay. We're finally down to one Claw Fiend, two racks over there, and one Raider for the Dark Eldar. And then we got the two um, Hell Drakes, two Rhinos, two little guys right over there, and then the Forge Beasts over there. So that's, um, that's it. That's game.